Today we talk about how much it costs to start riding in off-road. You might think it's expensive, I will surprise you. I'm Caribo and today I will help you and save a lot of money, but only if you subscribe the channel. Well, of course, you need a bike. My personal advice as a first off-road bike is better if you buy a used one. Then we have to choose if uh, we want a motocross bike or an enduro bike. The main difference between these two bikes is uh, one is made to ride in a race track. The other one has the on-road approval and you can ride in off-road from your house easily by riding. With a motocross bike, you need a van or a trailer to bring uh, the, the motorcycle from your home to the racetrack. We have the bike, we have the transportation, now we need the equipment. Helmets, boots, knee brace. Here you can't save money because these are your protection from injury, even very serious injuries. So you have to pay attention to what you buy. You need to buy very high quality and you have to take care that especially the helmet have the approval to be used in racing. Because this grants you your, your health and sometimes with wrong helmet you can have very, very bad injuries. If you want to save some money, you can save money on the pants, on the jersey, because it's, uh, it's something only about the look. I know that uh, you watch your favorite champions in television, but sometimes it's better to save some money there and spend a little more on the helmet. And now let me tell you a story about this, about safety and about uh, the materials. In 90s, as you know, I was a professional motocross rider and I accept uh, and I agree to, to use one uh, helmet that it was a prototype because honestly, they pay me a lot. But uh, I was a little worried because it, the helmet it looked, at the time was not so safe. But you know, they pay very well and that time it was an important matter. So I accept to use the tire. At uh, the first race, uh, during uh, the first part of the race, when uh, you ride all the 40 riders together, a big stone arrived on my helmet. I felt really strange, so I had to stop it. I removed my helmet and my helmet, it was broken, literally like an egg. From that moment, I understood that uh, you cannot care about the money when you are talking about safety. Because safety in health is not a joke. But now let's talk about the price. For a good helmet, you have to spend between 300 to 400 US dollar for a good entry level helmet. About the boots, boots, I think you can spend 200, 300 US dollar for a good entry level boots. If we are talking about the pants and the jersey, there, as I told you, don't look at your favorite champ and don't be the fashion one. You can save money, really a lot of money there. So you can spend under $150 for a complete set. You need the goggles. Goggles with 50, 35 to 50 US dollars, you can have a good quality goggles. But last but not least, talk about knee brace. Knee brace is something that often people don't take in consideration when uh, start in riding an off-road because uh, it's not absolutely needed to ride. But uh, probably uh, knees, it's uh, a place, a part of the body where when we ride in off-road, we have uh, the biggest injuries. Since, as may you know, I recently replaced my knees. Yes, I had a long journey in motocross and enduro races, but uh, I don't want to see you in my same condition. So, 3,000 for a good bike. Motocross and enduro is not a big difference. So, but if you choose a motocross bike, you have to add approximately 1,000 for a trailer. Then you have uh, 200 for pants, jersey, gloves, and googles. After that, we have uh, 200, 250 for, for the boots, 300 approximately for a good helmet, three, 400 for a good knee brace. For a total, that um, plus or minus is uh, $5,000. 
But if you want to save all this money, there is a way. Change sport. Because motorsport is uh, in any case expensive. For sure, if you try, you can't not go back because it will donate you amazing sensation and feelings. So now it's your choice. And also for today, we are done. But now tell me how much you spent. See you in the next video. Bye. Oh